All right. So they start off. Oh, oh. Okay, interesting. So he's gonna play Mark. Does he usually? Oh no, he usually goes Falcon. Yeah, that's I think he's confident today. Interesting. He's, he'll probably switch if if needed. Yeah. That or maybe uh, he's making the switch to you know good characters. Okay, wow. That was really nice. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Oh. 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 Beautiful. Okay, good. He yeah. Could have so... got a forward smash there, but. Oh, oh nice. okay. Wow. Okay. okay, so liberate. Dominating up first stock. Yeah, it was a beautiful stage spike. Because the regular back air might not have killed. Ooh, oh my gosh. Yeah, this is. <laughs> Cookie Monster is kind of getting rolled, run over right now. Yeah, I, honestly, he hasn't played this matchup in tourney as far as I've seen, so. Okay, wow. So that was kind of a slow. Uh, that was kind of a slow forward smash. And. I, I don't know. Pinky wants to not seem very comfortable approaching Doc. Uh, He's not really respecting his options enough. Yeah, a lot of questionable double jumping from Tom over there. Just a lot of like, he gets hit out and then he double jumps into a pill to try to get back in. Yeah. That's like equivalent to, to trying to come back down with like an aerial. It's just very unsafe and he burns his double jump in the process. Yeah. Um, yeah, so he should watch out for that. Yeah. Okay, so this should be death. Yeah, yeah, nice. Okay, wow. So. Uh, that, uh, that was pretty good DI. He almost actually... Well, he got closer to living, in, living than I thought he would. Yeah. Well, it still hit pretty hard. Yeah. Um, and... Uh, Alright, that should be the kill. Yeah, man. Alright, so let's see if we can bring back. Monster has been getting hit pretty hard by these down throws. Um, Liberate's getting a lot of percent off of them, and Mark typically has a harder time doing that. Hard time, uh, hard time converting off the throws. Oh yeah, yeah. It's not as straightforward, especially against Doc. Um, you pretty much have to trick him into wasting his double jump. Okay. Um, yeah. Interesting. So, Liberate, very confident play. Uh, and you can, you can tell because he's not even playing a whole lot. He feels very comfortable playing toe-to-toe uh, -to -toe with his opponent. Yeah, it looks like it. Um, and that's that's a good look. All right. All right, this is pretty dominating so far. Yeah, we'll see if Cookie Monster sticks to this. I don't think he will. Yeah, I don't, I don't think so either. But uh, forgot to we'll see. This. Oh. All right. And oh, okay. So he tried to get a reverse back air. Oh my gosh. Oh no, he throws that away. Yeah, unfortunate flub. Um, I really like how Tom's uh, mixing up his shield pressure right now, actually. Um, like, jabs, grabs, down smashes. Yeah, he's making it really... Like, Cookie Monster's having a hard time guessing exactly what he's going to do on the shield. Yeah, it's kind of like layering your offense, just keeping keeping them guessing when it's safe. Because, like, if they act out of shield at the wrong time, then Duck's down smash is generally there to hit them. Yeah. Also, another thing that Carl, or that Cookie Monster's not doing is a lot of times he'll be getting jabbed and he's not DIing them far away enough. So mm, yeah. uh, Lib a lot of times Liberate won't even have to do a dash. Uh, won't even have to JC grab. He's just doing a standing grab. Yeah. Usually oh. I see a lot of jab down smash. So maybe that's why he's not doing the DI away. Because he's afraid of the down smash hit. Yeah. Perhaps. I don't know. You can also crouch cancel the jab. Yeah. Oh, he's sticking to his character. Yeah, he is. Um, this is certainly interesting. Maybe, uh, yeah, maybe he just wants to figure out the matchup. Um, yeah, I'm not sure why, though. Yeah. Uh, I mean, I guess he can do whatever. Just make it keep him fresh, I think. Yeah. Oh my gosh. <laughs> so he, he's, oh, okay, that's not gonna work though, because um, Doc has those magnet hands. I'm surprised he didn't go for a grab though. Yeah. Because oh. you know they're going to shield after the whiff. Or spot dodge, I guess. Ooh, uh, good wave land. Oh, that was uh, not non sweet spot. Yeah, that <laughs> neither was that. Yeah. And that's going to cost him the, uh, the set. The second, one, <laughs> the second one might not have cost him if the shy guys weren't there. Because it actually made Marth's um, down tilt hitbox extend. Yeah, that actually made it a lot easier. Um, Interesting. He's doing a lot of... Oh, oh okay. wow. Okay. Uh, okay. So Trick him into going on yeah, stage. Nice. Um, so that's another thing that people Ooh, need to start doing. Oh down. my gosh, that's so dangerous. Um, but that's another thing that people uh, need to start doing better or more. The uh, sweet spotting the ledge, or or baiting baiting these marts on stage. Because yeah. a lot of times, like you can keep knocking them off with some weak hits and like reset the position. But knowing when exactly they're going to want to go on stage uh, is very important. Yeah, so I feel like very high hands. level marts might be able to get around that though. Like just reactionarily. Nice tech. Oh my gosh. Okay. Um, no, no random save. Yeah, I was thinking like um, 
like higher level marts might like watch their opponent. You know how kind of Austin kind of like won't go for the ledge if their opponent's gonna like bait him into trying to go for it. Yeah, yeah. he's very smart about it. Yeah. But uh. Oh, oh wow, that's unfortunate. Fandom. Okay. Um. So at Rising Star 64, Cookie Monster is usually a Falcon player. Oh wow, beautiful Tekken place read. He does keep his Marth for the Falcon matchup because he does struggle for, uh, with that. Yeah, he enjoys Marth versus certain spaces. Oh, okay. Uh, I don't. That was just a flood. Okay, that was very questionable. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I was confused. It, I mean, it was kind of confusing. Liberate don't actually almost kind of got in, hit into it because we got kind of baited into it, take, trying to take some stage. But once I think that's a little bit. Oh yeah, wow, that's bad. Yeah. <laughs> So this Yoshi story pick working out for him so far. Yeah, it doesn't seem like Duck has that many, like, as good of options for getting people off the ledge as other characters might. Because none yeah. of his moves really, like, poke at the ledge. Uh-oh. Uh I don't know, We should, uh, summon Tim after a set with Goobs, I guess. Yeah. Alright. Oh, it might be back. Who knows? Okay, so that's gonna- Oh, wow. So the shy guy actually keeping him closer to stage than he should have been, and I think Liberate was trying to get was trying to get that pill over the side of the platform through it earlier, but uh, that's gonna be it. If he oh, Randall does this yeah. right, no, no, Randall's coming. As soon as he withdraws from the right side, he always goes towards the left. Yeah. So, um, can you explain the Randall timer for people who might not know? No, I no. refuse. Oh, uh, that's kind of. I mean. Well, so you look at the tens digit, and it's uh, four to zero or five to zero, I guess, is um, when Randall's out on either side. And then you, wait, sorry, the ones digit tells you that he's out on either side if yeah. you, from five to zero. And then the tens digit, whether it's even or odd, will tell you if he's on the um, right, the left side or the right side. Yeah, okay. respectively. Okay. Even for left and odd for right. Yep. So any even tens digit will mean left, and the odd tens digit will mean the right. That being said, we are going on to the battlefield, uh, and Cookie Monster's gonna stay Marth. Um, he did okay, so I don't blame him. Yeah, he took a game. Uh, it might be a little hard on the stage, because Doc's heavy and gets a little more advantage from the giant blast zones. Yeah. Just larger blast zones. Alright. Okay, interesting getup. Cookie Monster. And now they're trying to feel each other out, kind of not not wanting to approach. I think Cookie Monster is definitely after that first game. He's definitely a little bit weary about approaching oh, Liberate. That was a beautiful back air. Oh, I didn't even realize Carl's already down stuck. I yeah. think I missed the first stuck. Oh my gosh. <laughs> uh, so, Maybe that was a hard read on the roll? I don't think so. So I think Liberate uh, is going to get caught out of his cape. And that's a stock for him. Caught throwing out a bunch of moves. Oh, there he's caught again. Uh, he managed just to not get jab reset. Oh, bad situation. No, Carl didn't capitalize. Yeah. I'd like to see more like up tilt up air in that situation. Oh wow, nice forward tilt. And that's that was be it. beautiful. Yeah. Yeah. Very strong showing from Tom right now. Oh yeah. It's like a close second game, but the first and this yeah, this game right now are looking game. pretty dominant. Uh, how's he gonna convert? Oh, misses misses a couple of up airs. Oh, wow. that's beautiful up B. Yeah. And oh wow, okay. Question will be <laughs> that time. Yeah, I think he panicked because he thought he was gonna get downered. So yeah, he yeah. It missed anyway. Um, but I think he thought thought it could have hit. So oh, that was great. How's he gonna? Okay, wow. So that actually sends him back on. Very fortunate for Cookie Monster. Very un unfortunate for Liberate. I'd like to see if uh, do you know if ledge hop up there to forward air would work? Like as Ooh. a, you'd have the DI mix them up, I think, because DI away doesn't quite work. I don't work. know. I think I feel like they the could crash is cancel too maybe. Floaty. Like I feel like he'd spend too long in the air. Oh, I'm talking about Doc's up air. So like the same Martha up, he's onto the stage. No, I know, but I mean like when you double jump on with the up air, I feel like you take too long getting onto the, the stage. Yeah. Like well, once they're on the stage. Drop low and then jump up air. Like yeah. I don't know. I don't know. It's it, it sounds weird. I'm curious. I've it's never seen Shroom do it, so it probably yeah. doesn't work. Or maybe it's just like a DI mix-up kind of thing. Like, if they DI into the stage, it might not work at all. 
Not just oh bad. wow, okay. He's sticking to his guns. This yeah. is uh but we should update the set counts. It's two to one. Oh yeah. So Liberty starting out strong in this game as well. Oh my gosh! And <laughs> Cookie Monster does not manage to speed spot that. Yeah. Was... Okay, nice new. Although he, <sighs> yeah. So Cookie Monster is playing just a little bit too close uh, for comfort. And he's getting caught out um, of a lot of these small little movements. Um, Oh, and, oh, unfortunate. That's he got caught under Battlefield. Yeah, when that happens to Marth, there's not a lot you can do at that <laughs> yeah, point. Yeah, it's a little sad. How's he gonna... Oh, I thought he was gonna force match. Alright, but he gets to force match, he gets him sent off. Let's see how... Nope, magnet hands. Oh, wow. Oh, no, and he misses it. Everyone should practice their ledge dashing. Yeah. It's different in tourney, to be fair. Like, even if you practice a bunch at home, like, the difference in pressure in tourney makes it harder. It's so interesting. So, Cookie Monster is opting to do a forward throw instead of an up throw. So, forward throw gives you a little bit of stage advantage um, in terms of pushing up to the corners. But I kind of like doing the up throw more, especially because Doc doesn't have a good way of getting out without double jumping. Yeah, I'm, I'm inclined to agree. Because, yeah, Doc's aerial mobility, once he's stuck in the air, just isn't that great. Yeah. Um, yeah, so Oh, they're... okay, wow. wow. So he fast fell that, um, he fast fell that pill. That was a huge mix-up, because he had not done that uh -huh. at all the rest of the set. I don't think I've ever seen him do it, really. <laughs> so, it's pretty impressive. showing some new tech. Uh, once again, not looking good. Yeah, was gonna... oh, wow. Looking pretty confused on the edge guards, honestly. Yeah, he's, um, he's not, not getting terribly easy in this matchup. It's not. Like, edge guarding Doc is not straightforward. Yeah, because you want to get rid of the pills, but then if you get rid of the pills, then he avoids your screen. Yeah, oh, okay. So and Yeah, that's that. <laughs> you missed that, but... So Liberate not happy about super that. Super tipper on the pill and the... Oh, okay. This could hurt. This is actually really close again. This is an early kill. Yeah. So it once looked like a grim situation. It's now turned into one with... I yeah, can't speak. Next hit. <laughs> uh, it's oh close anyway. Yeah. That's what he means. But, yeah. Oh! Oh, okay, wow. I thought so, he was baiting that option yeah. by doing that. Scary situation. <laughs> yeah. Oh, okay. Yes. Oh, nice! Ooh. That's crucial back here. Yeah. Oh, but he misses okay. another... Yeah, he, he oh, just he uh, didn't oh. time the ledge invincibility. Oh, he's missing okay. shield drops. He missed, he missed like three shield drops. Well, oh know, no, that was so dangerous. Pressure situation. This is extremely close. Yeah. This, oh, oh, oh my gosh. gosh. He just kinda, in. <laughs> he just crawls into the jabs. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> the yeah jabs it's hard. Zone.